Literature is used to mold young minds, but a nonprofit is hoping that it goes beyond that. A local woman began an organization using books to help children heal from trauma. Chicago Tonight's Joanna Hernandez tells us more about the local and international effort. How many of you love books? Do you guys have a favorite book? Meet Sina Jacob. She is the founder of the nonprofit Bookwala. Bookwala. More than a dozen kids recently gathered at a local Boys and Girls Club for a storytelling session. Jacob founded the organization back in 2009 when she says she began to question her life purpose and started to visit orphanages around the world. We traveled to Indonesia, India, Jamaica, Sri Lanka, passed out storybooks donated by kids here in the United States, which is fantastic. And the reaction that I saw on the ground in orphanages and for children again of trauma, the way they were looking with this faraway look, the way they were excited about the pop-up books, I just knew that I couldn't go back to the old way of life, my corporate life. That's when the Magic Crate program came to life. Small pop-up libraries placed in schools and orphanages. But I found that these books and the messages in these stories, which all children need to hear, the hero's journey, the hero's struggle, and overcoming something, coming out stronger, a happier world. It's so very critical, and especially for children who have lived with fear or insecurities or any type of trauma at all. And so reading is one of those major outlets where they too can relive that journey, overcome it, and realize that they could create a better world for themselves. What started globally has slowly grown locally. Magic Crate can now be found in Chicago, filled with a variety of books for kids to take. So we have it in corner stores, barber shops, related affordable homes. I got this book on More Than a Princess, and because she's pretty and like she's like a princess, but she's more than a princess. Mother and teacher Nancy Unzeta says the magic crates encourage kids to explore different topics. I believe the crates like this are going to open that question into parents. Children are going to come home with these books at home and ask for more books. They're going to ask parents to come into the program and parents are going to be remembered of the importance of taking a break and sitting down with your child, bonding and reading. For Jacob, her mission is driven from the passion she has of empowering kids to heal and dream. It help with this word. No child should ever cry at night, right? No child should ever cry. And we want to see them smile and laugh and all those things. And if we can give a simple gift like this and have that much power and magic, why not do it? Jacob says her goal for Bookwala is to keep expanding in Chicago. I truly believe that if these books were not here for me, I would not be here today. I believe these stories saved my life. And I know it has the power to save other children's lives. So go ahead and grab anything you wish. For Chicago Tonight, I'm Joanna Hernandez. And you can learn more about Bookwala on our website.